Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to Beaker's Lab. My name is Beaker and today we're going to get on my mini level three Clash Royale account and we're going to have some fun, man. We've got a magical chest in the bottom corner there. We're going to open it today and it is going to be sick. But also guys, we're going to look at some crazy matches today where we're going up against people that are twice our level. And I love it. You guys know I show this all the time, but I want to look at it again today because it's sick. And we're going to talk about how we do that. How do we beat people that are twice our level? Let's do it. Oh, this one was so much fun. So this guy right here is a level seven player. You can see we're level three. Wow. Awesome. Now here's the catch. It doesn't really matter. We don't know if he has good cards or not. We're going to have to wait to see. He might not have much better cards than me, but we'll see in just a moment. So you can see in the corner there, he has the balloon. And we don't know that yet, but we're going to have to watch out for that balloon because that thing can crush our towers real quick. That thing can crush our towers with just a couple of hits. So there he drops the minion horde. Nice play there. And minions as well. Are you kidding me, bro? I didn't really have my arrows ready, so I threw them, but it was a little late. We had already lost our tanking unit, the giant. So now we're going to have to get up there and just get a couple of hits in. Looking like we did, though. Whoa. <laughs> It was crazy. We just got like 600 hits right there. So not a great drop on the Valkyrie there. We should have dropped it a little further up. But it looks like that Valkyrie is about to get crushed. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. So now we're going to have to take care of those barbs some other way. Now, here's the thing, guys. When I'm playing against higher level players... Oh, I just screwed up again, dude. <laughs> Terrible minions there. When I'm playing against higher level players, one of my rules is to play really, really, really slow and try to not let this happen. If you play slow and you try to keep your elixir up, you might not get crushed. But right here, we are definitely getting crushed. We're getting lucky and not completely losing the tower yet. But that wasn't good. <laughs> that was not good at all. But that's to be expected. We know that we're going to get hit pretty hard here. This guy has some good cards. He's high level. So we're going to have to just play well. We're going to have to play slow and play well. Hopefully, <laughs> we can do both of those. So let's see here, man. I'm dropping the witch there. Using the witch for the first time in a while here. I actually haven't used it on this account at all. And the witch is pretty fun. I think the only problem I have with the Witch is it's expensive, but it's a very, very useful card with the splash damage and the skeletons, and it's it's great on defense and offense. That's really why I like it. So now we're up there, and the Witch is offering us a little splash damage, but not really enough. It looks like, yeah, we just couldn't get through that group, man. That group was sick. We're able to arrow there and take out the remainder of them. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. So it's... You know, it's not really happening for us yet. We're not really getting up there fast enough to get hits in. But we are still in this. This is not going to be a shutout. We know that. We know we can get up there and get hits. We just got to get some more. So really, usually the time that I get the win is at the very end of the game, you know? Really late in the game. Usually in overtime because you have double elixir at that point And maybe you've, you've sort of watched your opponent long enough to know what he's going to do. It seems like at this range... People just sort of cycle through the same cards in the same order. You know, like this guy's going to be just doing the same thing, same thing. Some, some players do it even more than others. So we can definitely counter him if we know what's coming. So there we go. We uh, had a balloon there and we arrowed over the top of everybody to take out the defensive cards. There it is, dude. We pushed from defense up to offense and kill that tower dude super fun dude i love doing this stuff let's go look at some more we have a lot more and you know a lot more we can check out let's do it all right what does this guy have uh similar stuff looks like he has the balloon he has the minions he has wow he's got some great cards look at these cards guys he's got some really fun cards to use like the musketeer like the mini pekka so hopefully we can defend here with the witch Wow, dude, that was perfect. The witch is so dirty. When you drop her at just the right time, the witch can be really useful. I mean, look at that. She just soloed like two or three cards. <laughs> I had to say, wow. <laughs> wow, dude. Anyway, we're up there getting some hits in. This guy's like, yeah, dude, I know. I'm awesome. People just do that, man. I'm like, I'll say wow, kind of like joking. And they're like, yeah, thanks. Okay, here come the goblins in the barrel, and we arrowed them. Always want to stay on top of those goblins, man. I just arrow them as soon as they land. You know, I don't want to mess with them. And then, look, I get trolled. He knew. He was trying to make me use my arrows so then he could easily use uh, the skeleton army, I guess. So we got to remember that. We know that he has a skeleton army. We can kind of adapt and try to maybe save our arrows for the skeleton horde. I don't... 
I don't know. Skull and army. <laughs> anyway, there's some minions and a musketeer. Is that going to be able to take down that balloon? No, dude. You can never... Almost never take out that balloon before it gets to the tower at my level. It just seems like it's so difficult to get. You got to get those minions down as soon as it comes off the bridge. Anyway, we're up there, dude. This is going to be it. This is going to be it right here. When you get that giant up there, look at that damage, dude. Wow, dude. What is that? 150 damage every time? And my giant is low level. So, you know, imagine once I get it to level... Four, I think is the next level. Anyway, nice defense there. We had the witch to sort of distract everybody. And we had some minions as well just to kill everybody. And it worked pretty good. And I think we're going to hit the tower right here. There it is. No, no, get it. Get it, dude. It's not really about the skeletons. It looks like, in, in, in my case, at this level, the witch is usually what's taken out the tower, you know, with her small but, you know, pretty quick uh, sort of shooter thing. Projectile? <laughs> is that is that the word I'm looking for? Anyway, uh, some archers and musketeer there seem to save the day against that balloon. We arrowed the goblins once again. What now, dude? Are we going to go for the three or what are we doing? It looks like we're going for the three. I'm not sure if we're going to make it or not. But we're going to keep putting pressure on this guy so he can't come back at us. Sometimes that seems to work the best, man. If you get somebody really flustered and you're just throwing cards at their king... You know, they can't get, they can't come back from it. Well, he's trying to. He's <laughs> just throwing goblin barrels and stuff. But it looks like he's not going to have time to get back up to the tower with only six, five seconds left. So we're going to get another win against somebody twice our level. Well played, dude. What? <laughs> what? Dude, the funniest thing is when a level seven player beats me, they spam the laugh over and over. It's like... Wait, just just checking. You are for real, right? Like, just just making sure you're for real. Anyways, we got a bunch more to check out, guys. Let's do this. All right, guys, here we go. Final one of the day. After this, we're gonna go open that magical chest. So stay tuned for that. So, what's up, bro? What are you doing? <laughs> I love this when you just like stand at the beginning and nobody does anything. Finally, he drops the mini Pekka and the baby dragon. They're gonna hit me pretty hard here with that splash damage, with that heavy hitting mini Pekka, but we're able to stop him miraculously. He only hits us a couple times with the musketeer. Wow, dude. Wow. So now we can transition from defense right into offense. We dropped our giant in front of our witch and our musketeer. We got this, dude. We got this right here. Come on, dude. Get up there. Go, go, go. Arrows. Throw the arrows, Beak. What are you doing? Through the arrows, they were a little late there, but we are getting some good hits in here. With those skeletons occupying the night, we just got the tower. <laughs> really quick, really nice tower. Uh, what am I trying to say? Tower take? Tower victory there? I don't know. Anyway, we took the tower really fast, and that's not usually what happens for me. Usually, I like to wait until way later in the match, but hey, dude, it works. <laughs> it works for me. So now we're going to have to focus on either the three or the two. We already got that King Tower down quite a bit, but usually I'll probably move over to the left side and try to take out that second tower instead. And we'll see what happens. So there's some goblins there to occupy that musketeer, took it out. Now we're going to go right up to the king. Looks like we are going for the three. Eros, Eros, what are you doing, Beak? Wow. <laughs> wow, that was just the best Eros I've ever seen, bro. <laughs> I just... Had to throw up the angry face there. That was terrible arrows. So anyway, we got a couple more hits. We're down to 1467. I would be surprised if we didn't get the three crown in this match. But again, I can't really remember what happened. So there's some arrows to distract. I mean, archers to, to distract. And some minions above taking out that prince. Taking out that knight. Beautiful, dude. Beautiful. I guess this guy doesn't have arrows or I don't see them. I don't know. I can't see if he has arrows or fireball or not quite yet. I can't remember if he does. But, uh, hey, we're doing good so far. So we got the giant down to distract. It looks like he's coming in with a nice push here. If we can stop this crew... Wow, we did it, dude. The arrow saved us right there. So now if we can stop this, this knight, we've only got 30 seconds pretty much left. All we got to do is defend. And we got this. So, wow. Still defending. Witch is so OP. I love the witch at this level. We drop a second witch. Look at this double witch action, dude. Wow, now we're coming up against a prince. That thing is going to get just destroyed. Whoa, whoa, maybe not, dude. Everyone sort of got distracted there. It looks like nobody was able to take on the prince uh, fast enough there. Look at this double witch, though. Get up there, dude. You guys got this. Come on, dude. 
No. Oh, dude, we could have had the three there if it wasn't for him sort of like dropping stuff on each side of us there. He, he sort of distracted us just long enough so we couldn't get the three. So that was really fun again, man. So much fun to do these. When you're going up against higher level players, they probably think you're going to be an easy match and boom, you get the win. So much fun. So let's go back and uh, do that magical chest now, guys. Where you at, bro? Where you at? There you are. So why don't we do this free chest first? Let's do that. What's in here? Cannon. Tombstone. Cool. Let's do this. Uh, what's this? A silver chest? Yeah. What's up, goblins? What's up, minions? All right, here it is, guys. We're going to do it right now. <laughs> I'm so psyched on this first magical chest we've ever done on this account. Here it is. Yeah. 300 gold. That is huge for us right now. Let's hit. Oh, goblin hut. I don't really use that yet. Archer's definitely going to definitely gonna use those. Definitely going to use those. We've got some skeletons. Nice. What's next, dude? Some bombers. Not bad. For this level, bombers are sick. Mini P.E.K.K.A. Yeah. Yeah. Sup, Mini P.E.K.K.A. So that's really good. We can get that thing leveled up. It's level one right now, as you can see. What's next? <laughs> Giant skeleton. Okay. Cool. And what's next? Oh. <laughs> Lightning. Oh. Okay. Here's what I think about lightning. I don't think I'm going to use it at this level because nobody really uses defenses that much. And I think lightning is best used to hit defenses tower, you know. Anyway, uh, let's go back, guys. That's going to be it for today. Let's start a uh, silver chest here and sign off. Let me know what you thought about today's matches and the chest opening. Not a real successful one. <laughs> I would say, you know, there were some cooler things that we could have gotten. But, you know, it's not like there's any... I mean, what else did we really want that's here? Eh, I don't know. Not a lot. I guess I would like the balloon. I don't have the balloon yet. I would have rather had that than the giant skeleton, but we'll see. You know, we'll get it soon. What arena can you get legendaries? Oh, the next arena we can start to get legendaries. I bet I'll get one right off the bat <laughs> on this account because I didn't get them on my other account. Anyway, whole story. Uh, that's going to be it for today, guys. I'll see you next time. Peace.